When I grow up, I want to be a graphic designer. When I grow up, I want to be a chef. What do you want to be when you grow up? Who will cross your path and change your whole direction? Welcome to the Cool Job Show, where you're going to learn about creative careers that you can love for life. Hi, my name is Christina Kazakia. I live in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, and I am an industrial designer and entrepreneur. I love my job and I can't wait to tell you why. I wear many hats as an industrial designer. I invented a product about seven, eight years ago called Sticklets, and they are these silicone rubber connectors that are super stretchy and they're used to connect and join sticks of various sizes. Sticklets were actually invented when I was in graduate school. My thesis was centered around reconnecting children with mother nature. My goal was to create a simple product that encouraged kids to get outside and play with natural elements while also developing a deeper love and respect for the world around them. As an industrial designer, I also draw and build lots of prototypes so I can get a better understanding of what the product is and how it acts and how the users relate to it. I occasionally go to toy and design trade shows uh, around the world. So far, I've personally been to a show in San Francisco, California, uh, here in Philadelphia, and also Milan, Italy, and Nuremberg, Germany. I was always drawn to beautiful products since I was a young child, and I didn't realize that I could study the subject until I was a freshman in college. I began my undergraduate studies at the University of Connecticut, where I studied business. I felt uninspired because I wasn't creating things and I wasn't um, making things with my hands and designing physical solutions. I transferred to Lehigh University where I studied design and economics. Before transferring universities, I also had the opportunity to spend five months in Greece where I studied archeology, span architecture, and economics. The fascinating stories left behind by these ancient artifacts that we studied really convinced me further that I wanted to pursue design. My Sticklets office is located in a huge, charming artist studio, very close to my home. So on nice days, I can walk here. It's a perfect space because I have my own room uh, to create, to package orders and store inventory. I don't come here to work every day. There are days I visit parks and schools to build forts with kids and families, right? Use your research. Um, some days I'm working alongside my photographer to capture new images for the website or product packaging or social media. Some days I'm working at a cafe with creative minds to find ways to collaborate and merge some of our projects together. I have a lot of flexibility as being an entrepreneur. That's something I love very much. Since I wear many hats as an industrial designer, I have many tools to complete the various jobs. So for instance, I have um, 3D printed molds and some silicone that I mix and pour into the molds um, so that I can confirm you know, the shapes, the sizes, the, the functionality and test them with sticks before I go ahead and make an expensive mold in Asia for mass production. I use Illustrator, Photoshop, um, InDesign, and Excel rather often in order to create my packaging and pamphlets and business cards and logo. I also use chipboard and bristle board pretty often um, when I'm developing new packaging. And of course, as you can imagine, I have buckets and buckets of sticks, um, bamboo, wooden dowels, and sticks that I gather from the woods so that I can create sculptures in my studio. I 
I have always loved building with my hands and telling stories through art. I found joy in making people happy. Looking back, I'd say my parents and high school art teachers encouraged me and gave me the confidence to pursue this path. I love my job because it never gets boring. I get to play and I get to watch people play. I get to go to toy stores to conduct research and I learn new things every week. But what really brings me joy is seeing kids and adults around the world having fun with the toy I invented. My advice to you is to be proud of your innate curiosity, the curiosity you were born with. Don't be shy to ask questions and don't be shy to ask for help. Hang on to the people who inspire you and support your passion because they will be the ones that help you make the connections you need in order to accomplish what you want. And start looking for internships as soon as you can. Not only do you develop so many new skills so quickly, but it gives you a great idea of what you may or may not want to pursue. I hope my little video inspires you to find a cool job that you can love for life. I hope this video inspires you to find a job that you can love for life. If this is your first time watching, consider subscribing to our YouTube channel to get our latest cool job videos featuring new creative careers. Also, consider sharing our YouTube channel with other people who you think would benefit from watching the Cool Job Show. Check out our other art teacher resources located in our description below. If you like this video, let us know by giving us a thumbs up or by leaving us a comment. Thanks for watching!